Hello everyone, welcome to an episode of my Dome Rock Bave Dirge through War, Divide and Conquer. Last time we took a settlement of Mergwood, I'm gonna exterminate it. Thank you. And let's repair it, because apparently we damaged the green exchange somehow. I have no idea. Did I damage that? I don't think I did. The Lamorks, they, they don't fix their own stuff. Hmm, stupid ones. Right, let's just build stuff. There we go. Smoking house. Huh, pipe weed. Right, I thought I only had hobbits had that, apparently I have it as well. Great. <laughs> Alright, let's go through the forest because I know there's some Onward. settlements in the forest. Let but us I also know that here. Earth for BG might not be a good thing because the elves are taking it, so it might be useless. I do know that because I watched like two episodes ago. I watched with Toggle Farm, so I do know they're attacking it, but I'm not sure how far they are. Uh, my faction leader is over here. I looked him up before. Where is he? Protect there he is. the blood of Numenor. Let's go further to the Marchmen. I'm going to retrain these guys because look at them. Let they're us silver. set up camp here. They're silver experienced, as you can see. These guys are bronze. I think they're bronze as well. These guys are silver, I believe. No, they're bronze, but three bronze are almost silver. So I do want them retrained. They're pretty strong. And also, we are here. There we go, that one is, is actually rebelling Ready. still. Looking Let us for set up Rune. camp here. Rune is being pushed back by Gondor last time I've seen them, so let's hope Gondor is gonna do a good push on them because or keeps them busy while I reclaim their land. Also hope that the dwarves will keep them busy here. Just so I can take over without much of a fight. Vale is still living some uh the Vale of the Ring is still living somehow. Normally they get crushed, but you know. It's it's a toss up. So let's end the turn. Oh yeah, that's my second army moving towards Mirkwood to finish them off. Probably they're gonna divert to uh, Rune afterwards because I don't think Mirkwood will last for long because they're getting a constant assault by everybody. I might actually send them to the Orcs of the Misty Mountains and purge them out of the mountains. Maybe that's also a plan. Purge the, the Orcs out of the mountains and as soon as the Orcs of the Misty Mountains are gone, well. I think Casa Doom can flourish, and also the elves of the elves and Bree can, you know, and Dunedain can flourish together with the dwarves. I mean, push them out of the uh, the realm. I don't know. I mean, there only are three evil factions, well, four evil factions left: Rune, Orcs of Misty Mounds, Orcs of Gundabad, of Remnants of Magmar, sorry, and what are you doing? And of course, Mirkwood, and Mirkwood is on the ropes, Rune is getting pushed back, Gonna, well, Rangmar is getting their asses beaten, the only one that's actually still stable is the Orcs of Misty Mountains. Rune being the strongest though, so... Oh, let's upgrade this place. I mean, I'm literally overpowered, I'm literally an unstoppable powerhouse now, because... I have all of these cities to back me up and just push north. I'm actually unstoppable now, but, you know. Overall, I'm still not the strongest faction, which is interesting to me. How am I not? I mean, really, I should be so strong, I'm unstoppable. Almost. Let's upgrade it. Oh, let's build mines. Yeah, it's giving me way more. Yeah, let's build that. Not that I need the money fast, but... Yeah. You can never have enough money, right? I'll probably have to do this off camera just to make sure everything is building still, but probably gonna do that off camera. As you guys, I mean, it's part of the game, but of it's not the most interesting Onward. stuff to watch. Okay, we're in Rune Lands once more. Camp here. There has to be something here, right? I should have asked the map. Let us set up camp here. <laughs> Maybe I will. Huh. Where's my diplomat? Where's my diplomat hiding? Maybe I can ask him have information if I give them money, I don't know. Yes, my lord. Alright, so... Oh yeah, I was gonna talk to the dwarves, wasn't I? Was Impossible. To to what is it you wish to talk about? I don't know, you're not of the lore. Thank you. Give me map information, please. Come on. I like the fact that it's generous and taking ages to, to even find it out. Agreed. There we go. But all very well. It took a very long. What's your next suggestion then? Yet they don't want the lines with me still. Aye, farewell. Uh, 
should have asked for the map information afterwards. Right, which faction do we not have talking to yet, except the evil factions? We have talked to every evil faction in the game. Oh, well, actually, no, they're still Endweight. Endweight is also still left, but they're neutral for me, so not really evil. Um, yeah. I guess I'm gonna go talk to... Sylvanels? Yeah, I'm talking to them, apparently. I'll go talk to them. Maybe I've taken over. Uh, Approaching their dignitary. Maybe I've taken over, and I can Stopping see that. Stopping here. Emlaters. Is Alan still alive? I wonder. They do have mass, good armies. You can see they have the elite forces here, so they can take all. If I had those forces, I could have taken over the Orcs in this mountain in two seconds. Holy Captain crap. of Gondor. All right. Searching for. Look. I should have recruited. Oh, there we go. Slay them. I should have recruited more spies, to be honest. Let us claim this field. Let's build some ladders, you never know. That's a lot. Oh. Well, I guess we'll be fighting trolls soon, I think. <laughs> oh god. I've fought in those before, actually, to be honest. I've fought in with them. Ready. I don't think they were that powerful, to be honest, but... Let us sit up camp here. They're pretty... They're pretty good. Awaiting your command. <laughs> Alright, so they're moving up more. I might need to send these, these armies to Mirkwood. So they're moving towards Mirkwood. Probably they should move over here somewhere. Uh, Trandewil is... I'm not sure... Actually, I'm gonna go talk to Trandewil. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I'm gonna talk to. Where's my diplomat here? Where are you, diplomat? There you go. Yes, Click my lord. Down. Go to Trandewil. If Find only somewhere. I could. Tomorrow's I journey farm. planned out. I am, because it was blocked. Orders. Oh yeah, you're gonna retrain. Yes. You were blocked I off, weren't you? Protect the blood of Numenor. happens, because you need to re Forward. your stuff. Move, move over here somewhere. Marchmen. Forward. Let's end the turn, shall Let we? You probably will get attacked at Dorlinvar, so it's kind of good. Oh, really? <laughs> what? <laughs> What are Rud what are Rudor Axemen doing here? I can understand the orcs, but I can understand the Rudor Axemen. Now do I understand the Hillmen. These guys come from Riven though? Look at that. The lands to the north of the are considered desolate and empty. These guys come from how did you guys get here? What? I'm gonna auto resolve it, but I lost one guy, really? Why did I lose that one guy? Oh well. <sighs> That was interesting. Where did that where did that army suddenly come from? I like the fact Gondor is having armies in Mordor still. <laughs> I like that fact. Uh, Kingdom of Dale, Vale of Anduin. Dwarfs. Hmm. Oh well. They probably are doing fine. I mean. So yeah. Come on. I need to go killing. Come on, Rune, I know you're trying to kill me. Huh. Wait, what? what Tomorrow's I... journey planned out. Why did my diplomats move? Five turns. Awaiting your command. Five turns used to see you. Holy crap, evil is really losing everything. Holy crap. Your orders. There really are. Yes. So I have to go back. Oh, really? They're doing like that. I can't pass that way now. They're going to pass. So Airbor is extremely powerful, it seems. I cannot do that. Without question. Let's go that way around. Stopping really. here. Well, I guess I'm gonna see map information from the other guys. So I guess that's good. Jump forward. Nice. Enough turn of vault. Interesting. Captain so I of might Gondor. attack that, but I'm gonna first do something else. That F Camo Shadow just the um. Forces of Gondor. Marchmen. Let's go looking for Rune. Let us set up camp here. Also, let's move up this army first. We'll attack in a second. It's gonna be a very Protect hard battle. the blood of Numenor. Rolls defending a city. Jesus. Forward. Well, they're more pretty, actually they're more strongly Onward. attacking than defending, to be honest. But yeah. awaiting your command. Let's see what Assault they have. The enemies of Gondor. They have three thousand men. They have this guy, which apparently has one hundred. Oh, Uruk. Yeah, very Uruk. Wow. Portrait is not there. Wait, it's not a good commander, but what do they have left? 
Hunters, stalkers, nothing. Blade masters, hunters. They have a very strong force. Oh my. Um, I will fight it though. It could be interesting. They have a lot of archers. Uruk archers. Though my archers are far superior to theirs. They do have the straw, so they will be the the pain. I will fight it though. Seems fun. All right, I'll be seeing you guys in the battlefield. Break their will. Alright, let's deal with the man. Now, I don't hope trolls are on top of the wall. That would be devastating for me. Now, I'm not really sure where the hell they're gonna be. So, it's one of those elements. Eesh, those are nasty ones. That's a nasty element because I think, but they are just here and you have to go all the way around here. There's not many paths to go in. Huh. Um, 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 um. I might actually. Right. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. So, first, let's put the archers. Only four archers? Eesh. Oh well. I'm not gonna fire the trolls, it'll be a waste of my arrows now. Um, let's send these guys into the. They're my least valuable units to lose from archer fire. Infantry. I have a lot of infantry though, so I should be able to do some damage to them, right? Infantry behind. Um, these guys will go forward. These guys are not in my infantry line. There we go, now they are. My cavalry, I can't really sadly use them fully, but I will try to use them as much as I can. And let's get these guys. Probably invade the wall over there. They seem to have a lot of men. Alright, right, right. Let's pause for a second, see where they all are. You guys go there. They have a massive force here. Um, they have the trolls here. I wish I had catapult so I could destroy this thing. That would be amazing, but I don't. So, kind of sad about that. Uh, you go over here, and you go over here. You guys can run in there. Thank you. You guys can't run. Archers, fire at one of this. One of the hell shadow arch, definitely. Um, one can fire the troll. We can up a bit, and maybe I can fire over here. Not yet. So fire at the blade monsters here as well. There are two units, I believe, because they overlap here. There might be two units here. It's worth fighting two guys at that. So the trolls are in a very bad location, actually. To be honest, if I had catapults, they would be dead. But yeah, I don't have catapults, so I'm gonna take some archer fire, though, which is kind of irritating. I probably should spread out my men, but. Not gonna worry about it too much, considering they're being bloodied up and they're taking some beating of damage. These guys are un unscaled though, and they're gonna fight archers, so they should be fine, even when ladders. Siege towers are more efficient, but they're slower, so the arch fire will be shut down soon. I'm not gonna go up the tower. I'm not gonna go up the wall here. That would be a waste of my arch. It actually would be a waste of archer fire, wouldn't it? Okay, focus on this unit now. Let's help fire at my own men then. And you fire at the trolls. Our men have reached the walls with their ladders! They have been bloodied a bit, but not enough I believe, to be very efficient. They also have a lot of men here. Those are not too many. Actually, let's see if I can use one of my guys here. No, I cannot. Um my guy should be fine, I hope. They should be. Considering we're fighting archers. We'll see soon. Are the trolls doing one of them died yet? No, of course not. Of course not. The battery ram is in place. This. There we go. Not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. How are the archers doing? They're doing very bad. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> These guys are also fighting. They're losing though, so. Yeah, okay. I'm winning on that part. Almost the gate is down, so let's get the infantry moving up. They can walk up. Gate's about to be breached. I wish I had a little bit more. Like a catapult to make a breach here would be amazing, but of course that's not happening. Um, probably could have waited one more turn, but, but 
fire at that Wudok Archers over there, and you you can't fire over there, but you can however fire at some stalkers here. No, you can't fire at those guys here, all of them. Um, I can ignore these guys. Holy shit. They're firing fire as I mean, I have to keep an eye on that one. Quickly, let me see it, because there we go. I knew they were firing at me. Thank you. Alright, so actually I'm winning this fight significantly. So I breached through. Let's get the guys inside now, shall we? I'm not gonna send all the infantry inside, I'm gonna send these guys inside. These guys. Still moving up. I will send them in later. I wish I had a, a breach here so I can send men in here, but I don't have that yet. Probably could send them out the, the, get, uh, the tower. I'm gonna send these two. I'll fire the ladder if I can, of course. Now, these guys are dying horribly. Probably need to see one unit after these guys as well. Probably gonna send these guys after it. Or one of my hidden guns. Go after that one. These guys are fine. We'll fight the wall here. I wonder how these guys are doing. In the middle. They are breaching through significantly, as you noticed. I'm cutting them down. We've captured the enemy's walls. The walls are mine. The, the towers are starting to become mine. We got a breach here. Can I, I think ram and breach that? No, I can't, of course. Um, archers can move up a bit. Archers move up over here. The trolls are just standing there. That's interesting. You get up there. And you. Run to the trolls and start killing trolls. Thank you. My Haven Guard is moving up here against the archers here. They're also fighting some armor defenders, but I don't think they will do too well against me. Alright, um, I'm doing some men over here, which is kind of saddening me, but I'm breaching through quite well. Okay, these three, two units will try and get over here. And reinforce these guys. The straws will be going against me one by one, which is not really good for them. I do know that. My guys need to be fighting back though, which is interesting. No, they're not fighting back. Let's hold them for a second. They will also fight again once more. These guys are taking the first hit of my the enemy attack. So archers, you can redirect yourself towards here, to the hunters over here, and all of you guys can fire at that. I'm using archers though, which is never good. These guys are moving upwards and probably can fight the little archers here. I'm gonna make them. Not really sure about my haven guard. Okay, let's get my cavalry in here. I haven't used them. Let's get my cavalry in here and get them over here inside. They should be able to pass without much effort. I can use them to flank and such. Watch the firing. You guys are need to move up over here as well. Get in here, please. Thank you. Ooh, the bodyguard. That bodyguard's here. I can take him out. That would be amazing. Everyone's fighting, but you, you're not fighting anymore. So I'm not sure what you're doing, but you're we're fighting the trolls, but they suddenly have left. So interesting. Go after them. Thank you. Try and help out their general, which is never good. Go after the trolls, quickly. It's only a small charge, but hey. Nah, that nothing really. Okay, um. All this infantry. Go after that. I have to go after these blade monsters first, and then go after the block. You're not similar fighting, what are you doing? I told you to go after the trolls, didn't I? Now these guys are getting smashed, because they're separated and they don't have any reinforcements coming for them. Quick, hold them out. Alright, so cavalry over here, come on. 
Okay, infantry is dead. Let's send some reinforcements to the closer as well. Get them surrounded, don't make them run away. These walls are pretty strong still. Yeah, slow about. These guys are getting smashed there. Okay, um. One of them died yet? Oh, one of them did. Two of them now. Okay, cavalry is still moving up to where it should be going. Nice. The cavalry charge into the stalkers here. Archers are all out of arrows, it seems. We can get my archers back. They're not going to do much anymore. Get them completely back. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. I'm losing love, man. I don't like that. So I'm fighting with the bodyguards as well. The bosses over here. You are not fighting. You guys will go to the center, I guess. Oh, I'm going towards the center. You will stay behind. You'll be inside the settlement. You'll stay here and guard the gate, I guess. Three of you guys. Well, actually, I'm going to diverge you guys to go over here. Let's also speed up a bit. Yeah, that's fine. Let's speed up to two times speed. Meantime, my general's having fun with stalkers and skirmishers. They'll be having fun with that. Trolls are still fighting me. Which is never good. They're fighting to do the gorgeous here. Nice. Then we'll go for the snogged arm defenders. The trolls are about to die. Four of them. They should be almost dead, all of them. They should be really weakened up. Uh, take some archer fire, of course. Yes. Yeah, I'm taking quite an archer uh, fire. Then these guys will go this way. These guys can run in. Our men have slain the oh, enemy nice. general. There we go. Without him, it's about time actually. Lose That's their very fight. Long. Right now, you guys get back over here. Let my infantry deal with them. Run through them. Come on, just run through them. Don't fight them. Run through them. I know you can do it. You're way too sturdy for that. Else, um, infantry here is. These guys will, these guys, maybe I'll leave them behind, but they're very valuable to leave behind, so. Kill them off, please, thank you. Can't use cavalry, which is kind of saddening to me. You're still fighting, but you're not doing anything anymore. Lift the stroll, please, will you? Actually, you two. You're not in the fight, so get over here. Get over here. Now it's cutting them up, really. It's in the square. It's gonna take a lot of work. They will die eventually. Charge into that. Infantry. There's infantry here, not in a good position, but let's move them over here. So they're in a very good position to fight them at all sides. Then I'm gonna break, so might as well just, you know. Good charge, should do some damage here. That was a lame ass charge, but we're killing them. We're gonna take horrible losses though, which is never good. Um, some guys here. Alright, let's get these guys all over here. These guys as well. Carl, we can keep charging in there as soon as they can. 20% of my men are dead. I will hold the front though, but I'll take massive losses. And my charges are very inefficient, as you probably noticed. These guys do something else. These guys can go over around. Actually, no. Cavalry goes around over here. You can try that. And from this side. This side should be even good to hit. And now we just watch the killing. On this massive, massive line. I 
Actually, I like, I've enjoyed this immediately. Oh, we're also fighting over here. Nice. We're gonna increase the fighting location by putting some men over here. They, they caught their, their line themselves, but I'll help them out a little bit like that. Calvary need to run, thank you. A good charge here could do so much damage, but... Infantry, come on, get over here, like, over here. Completely the surround them. Bloodied. They have lost half their men. That would be amazing. I completely surround them. Now, hit them over here. Should be able to... The AI, should, yeah, the AI is going to bring them like that, okay. So these guys are... Breaking through. They're being surrounded here, completely. It's nice. If you just look at the line, and just see only almost orcs. It's orcs up there, really. That's amazing. You just see my men slowly crouching forward, getting everything done. This shot should be good. Be right in their backs. That's done a fair amount of damage, actually. It did. They did something there, so can't say too much about it. This line's about to break, really. This is the only blob they have left. It's about to break. This one is not gonna hold. Let's get the last guys in the back over here. Get my cavalry one more time in there. And yeah, they're about to break here. These guys have, are gone. Nice looking fight, I think. Nice. Yeah, now it's just cutting up work. I'm gonna let my general stay there because now you can just see them getting surrounded. Everybody can verge on that. Killing everything in the way. These guys are holding my men back here. Don't be flung. There we go. They're gone. Now it's just slowly, as you can see. Last defense, but they will not work. These guys are just walking in. They don't even care anymore. Just walking in with spears forward. Oh my. Look I'm entering command of the castle. Oh really? We're in command of the castle? Yeah, I doubt so. Actually, oh man, I want to see the orc corpses. Oh man, I want to see the entire orc corpse in the middle here. Let's 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 see if we can get that. Um, let's get my men backwards. I mean, I might be used. I want to see the corpse corpses quickly. I'm um, hurry up a bit. Yeah, look, look at all the corpses. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at all the slaughter here. The slaughter's over here the same, actually. There's actually Our one... Men no longer command the castle. There's one guy left, actually. He won't do much, but look at all the slaughter. Yeah, I took some losses, heavy losses. I took some losses over there as well. The troll, actually, lost massive losses of trolls, but... Yeah, look at look at these. Oh my. And now let's kill the guy that's left. It's one guy. Everyone run in there. <laughs> look at actually look at this. This is where I started fighting them and you can just see the line. I lost some men in between. I mean the blue spots are mine, but that's about Our it. Our men really. have taken control of the castle. This guy will crush him. Oh no, he crushed him. There we go. We awed by the victory we have won here today. So another it was a very long siege. What can I say? It's a very long siege. I lost a lot of men in my opinion. Four hundred and twenty men is not what you want to lose, but I mean trolls, 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 trolls. They did quite a number on me. They ended with your general bodyguard too. They did do good damage on me. Plus my unit was very stupid there because it was like pouring in one by one, not in as, as an entire unit, which was interesting to me. But that's the eye of your unit, so everyone killed a lot actually, except these guys, not really. Hmm. Probably was the even gods that was in the back and not fighting a lot, I guess. Um. The archers didn't do as much as I thought they would, it's only 130. I did fire, focus a bit on the trolls, which didn't really do much to be honest. But oh well, we see you guys on the 
pay me up, see you guys in a sec. Alright, that was a pretty fun battle actually. I enjoyed that one to be honest. Well, like Sturmian's location as well. Victorious. Wasn't probably my best fight, but eh, it's a bit, uh, no, actually, it was fairly decent, I believe. Let's leave these guys behind. I know they're very costly, but they don't get a fight anymore. They only cost 100 now, so they're not that costly anymore. So there probably is one more settlement here, I believe, in the woods over here somewhere, and then over here we'll go to Mirkwood. So let's look it up, shall we? Let us set up camp here. What we can do is put a little watchtower here, so we can increase the vision. Ready. This apparently is the... This belongs to Dale, so there's nothing really there anymore. Mirkwood is on his knees, apparently. Should go, uh, sh I also should go talk to Dale and see what they have. So that's Dale. I'm not going to go into the land because they might declare war on me. Because Let us set up camp here. Logic. They don't like, they won't like me for that, but... Let us set up camp let's see what here. we can do here. Resistance is futile. Uh, yeah, of course. Army routes. It was a nice slaughter fest, what can I say? Um, we might actually not need the second army here. Uh, I might actually send them to the Orcs of the Misty Mountain, clear them out of, purge them out of their mountains. So let's end the turn here, see what happens. Oh yeah, I'm going to retrain that unit. It's like a sil like two silver experienced uh, Nimble Doll Archer unit, which is really good. Well, I actually have an issue here, because now suddenly, all of a sudden, I actually pushed the wrong button, and I'm now adding this actually in post-processing. The thing is now I pushed the button with my microphone, and actually I muted my microphone, which is really annoying. But as you can see here, I mean, I'm just ending the turn. Not much really happens of importance, to be honest, in this episode anymore. But we are, however, I was talking about how, you know, how the factions were going, and how, how actually the war is progressing between all of these factions, and what's going on. And I definitely did notice that... Evil is, I mean, I noticed before that evil is actually getting lost horribly. Evil is getting, well, destroyed in every front. I mean, Rune is on the verge of dying. I don't like that guy, I don't want him. Rune is on the verge of dying, and, you know, as you can see here, Karasan is reclaimed, so Rune is being pushed back by them, even. They're so weak. Gondor is batting on the gates, I'm ba batting on the gates, and now you can see actually that. Bree is making war with dwarves, so if I actually have to make a war with a good faction, which I possibly will have to do, not a certainty, it will be with Bree, because Bree is the biggest powerhouse in the world at the moment, together with me and Gondor. I'm not gonna portray Gondor, I'm gonna leave them be, but I am gonna, you know, fight the good faction, it will be Bree, because it's the strongest faction I can fight, I have the biggest land, and you know, it will be the most interesting war. Of course, also they became evil because they attacked the dwarves there at Lewin and not a good faction, so I consider them a bit evil, right? I can ally them and become the most powerful. I mean, they are armor, I can consider that they are armor, and that they are the northern kingdom of Dunedain, but, you know, I'm not gonna take that as canon. Also, I did, I still was wondering, like, why... Is, am I not as the biggest population, even though I have like settlements like Umbar with 23,000 population, as you can see. There's almost no way. And they have cities of 19,000, yes, but I have a population of... F and I'm just looking at what I can build here, because I just look at it and see how much population I have inside. Just to figure out, why do I have, you know, population lower? It's interesting. But yeah, like I said, evil factions are getting horribly weakened. They have n almost no way of winning anymore, and... I probably will have to make wage war with a good faction. It's interesting. Now I'm still trying to look what? for the Rune guys here, but I just, as you can see here, there's a, a border here, so Formation. there's a border. Here, so I know there's somewhere still in this border somewhere. I'm not sure where though. Like I said, I probably should have asked map information when I could. Sir. But yeah. Marchmen. So we're marching towards Mirkwood, and we do see Mirkwood's is still lives here, I believe, what? because you can see the border. There we go. You can see the border, so Mirkwood has, still has Barakudu under their control. So the Galadrim Ralphs did, however, um, fail. So, I'm just looking at my settlement a little bit, and I just noticed that there's actually some Haven Guard there. <laughs> I was like, why do I have Haven Guard here? Quite expensive to keep there, but, you know, I just have them. Now, I noticed that Mirkwood has nothing of strength left, almost. They're just weak as hell as well. 
six after they had trolls. I mean, there were pretty good trolls there, but not much to be left at. So I decided to go well, for what? Ruin with his army. I mean, Ruin still has vast Let lands. It will take forever to take with one army, so definitely the army will not last long enough because they can't last long enough. Actually, I lost that much money. And my diplomats can't seem to get through anywhere. As you can see, the trolls are blocking them in every freaking front. So yeah, it's kind of annoying. To be honest. But yes, yeah, so be it. It's the name of the game, I guess. Um, not really that I need my diplomat. I have most factions I've talked to anyway. That was one of the dwarves that died, I believe. So, yeah. I'm not sure which dwarf that was, but it definitely was a dwarf that was dying. So yeah, evil factions are all about to die. I mean, I've, what factions do I have left? Rune, Angmar, um, Mirkwood, and... Misty Mountains, and in the end of the episode, something really, really interesting happens. I believe at the end of this turn. Give me a second. Is it like that? I think. Yeah, I think it is. So the climb. I believe you will see it in a second. High pass cleared. There we go. Goblin Town has been taken by the Dwarves variable, which is like, whoa, okay. So they actually took it. And now the interesting part comes. Now yes, done. my lord. Done with no bit my. Trying to get my yes. diplomat past this location. I shall continue Once. tomorrow. I mean, he's been there forever. So that's been cleared. Come on, it's about time. <laughs> I'm actually hyping this. Nothing really happens. Now is it? Probably some of you can, you know, guess it, I guess, already. There's still falls of Marco there. God damn it. And there we go. Faction is destroyed, which is the thing I really wanted to see. Faction destroyed. So, Mirkwood is dead. So, we have left, left, well, wrong button. If we have left here, we have the enemies, only four A left, and Angmar is on his knees, Mirkwood is on his knees, and Anadweed is on his knees. Only Rune is the only one with a little bit of power left. And I was saying before, like, oh, most of these mounts are doing fine, nothing has been taken from them. Yeah, I was wrong. They're actually dead. Fear my blade. Now, I'm still trying to look for the rune here. And Let yeah. us set up camp here. Very interesting, isn't it? So Let us set up camp here. As you can see I found the, the roads there, so I'm trying to look for them via the roads, but yeah. I'm gonna see. Like I said, I will probably fight a war with Bree if I have to, but Bree will be it will be an interesting war, can't deny that. So yeah, let's go towards Barad Kultur, and I actually Marshman. then Mirkwood should be dead as well, and if Mirkwood's dead, us set up camp here. then I will be concentrating on Rune, and if Rune's dead, well, Let us set up camp what here. is left? I can go for Angmar, but <laughs> Angmar probably is dying from the Dunedain, or from Erebor, so, there's no, almost no point. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, please comment and subscribe, and see you guys next time.